Okay, Xiomara, Ivan, how are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, uh, well, I have a flu. Uh, sorry to hear that. Yes. Did you go to the doctor? It hurts in the afternoon. Oh. And I have this thing I, I have a hearing at but I feel very, very bad. My nose. <laughs> mm, I can imagine. But always you are blowing your nose. <laughs> yes. And it hurts. Yes. 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 Hmm. <clears throat> How about you, Ivan? How are you? How do you feel? Good evening, teacher. Well, it was great. My day. I feel happy. Oh, tell me, why was your day great? Because uh, I have had near uh, 20, 20 childs in my class. They fool my class full with my Okay. My child. The children. Children, my children. Mm hmm Or the students, right? Ivan? Yes. What what do you teach? Uh, informatica. Okay. Okay. Uh, tomorrow will be a day off. Ah, tomorrow. Why tomorrow's a day tomorrow. off? Tomorrow. It's my day. It's my day. Uh, we we'll go uh, uh Lake Apulo, Apulo Lake. Oh, you don't work on Thursdays? Yes. Really, very strange. Every Thursday, every Thursday you don't work. Every Thursday, every Thursday, day off. Wow. And Saturday and Saturday and Sunday, too. Okay, interesting. Yeah. <laughs> good, good. Uh huh. Very good. Yeah, it's a little bit unusual because normally in the schools you have to work Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Uh huh. Yeah. Yes. Okay. All right. Good. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna turn this off. My apologies. Okay. So, sorry, Nelly. How about you? How was your day? Hi everyone. Hey. Uh, my day was huh? yes, we can hear you. Mm -hmm. It was uh relaxed. <laughs> relaxing. Yes, relaxing. Okay. Mm -hmm. Because uh, mm -hmm. today I was in the house. Uh, I only to care my children and prepare, cook the breakfast, the lunch. I went to the church and that's it. Do you, do you go to church every day? No, only Saturdays, Mondays at night and Wednesday at night too. Okay. Hmm. Uh -huh. So three days a week. Yes. On Fridays we have a meeting in the in the house. In your house. And um, sometimes it's in my house. Uh, another Fridays are in different houses. Okay. So you have like a little community. Exactly. Okay. We call them PC. 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 In Spanish, pequeña congregación. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Okay. That makes sense for the PC. Yes. Are you the leader of one of them? Excuse me? Are you the leader? No. 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 David, it's the leader. And my dad. 
Ah, okay. Uh -huh. Okay, so it's is and is both the men and the women together. Um, now oh. the time. Uh huh. Because I I remember if I remember correctly, sometimes they have the PCs only for men and the PC only for women, or no? No. No. It's a um a familiar meeting. Okay, so always the both the men and the women are present. Yes, and oh. the children. Oh, okay. Children. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, pretty nice. Well, I'm glad that everybody had a pretty good day. Um, we are ready to practice today. Today's topic is speaking. So we already learned a little bit about yesterday about rules and things that we have. Today we're going to do a small listening example. And also we're going to have a little bit about the rules and we're going to do it together to make sure that it's clear for everyone in case somebody didn't do it before. So let me share my screen with you. This is 4.9, 4.9, here we go. So we talked about many of these different switches, these different symbols, if you recall, if you remember, we had all of these different things. So lock your bikes in the bike rack which picture is this? Which one is lock your bikes? Letter F. Letter F, exactly. Mm -hmm. There we go. What about no eating or drinking in the classroom? Letter A. Letter A, okay. Good. And no playing ball in the hallway. H. H, letter H. Letter H. Okay, good. What about keep the classroom door closed? D. Letter D. Letter D. Okay. Good. No pets allowed on campus? C. C. Great. And throw all the trash in the waste uh in the waste paper basket. D teacher. E. G. G. Which letter? I think it's G. G. Okay. Good. G. Mm -hmm. And don't open the windows. E. Okay. Wonderful. And that means the last one. Turn out the lights when leaving. B. 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 Perfect. All right. So as you can see, we have all of those. You should have those already completed and correct. Uh, F, A, H, D, all correct. C, G, E, B, all correct. All right. Now we're going to listen to some people. Okay. We're going to have to decide if it's true or false each statement. So there are three conversations about driving. We're going to have man number one the woman number two, and then others in number three. So listen if it's true or false for each one. Page 96, exercise 11, listening. What's in a sign? Part A, listen to three conversations about driving. Check true or false for each statement. One. Oh, no, not another parking ticket. That's the second one this week. Why did I get a ticket for parking here? I thought this was a free parking zone. Maybe you can only park here after working hours. Is there a sign around anywhere? Oh, you're right. There's one over there. I didn't even notice it. Looks like you can't park here till after 6 p.m. How much is the fine? Would you believe it? Sixty dollars. Two. Okay, so let's take a look first part one. We're going to listen again, but let's take a look. The man hasn't had a parking ticket lately. True or false? 
False. False. Okay. Parking isn't allowed there during working hours? True. 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 Oh. Okay. The fine for parking is $16? False. 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 Okay. Good. Let's listen now for number two. I wonder why that traffic officer is signaling me. Perhaps he means you're driving too fast. No, I don't think so. The speed limit is 60, and I'm only going 55. Hmm. I wonder why there are no other cars in this lane. What do you mean? Well, you see how the other cars are all in the lane next to us? You're right. I think this one is just for buses and taxis. They really should put up better signs around here. Three. Okay, let's take a look. Number two. The woman is driving faster than the speed limit? False. False. Okay. There are other cars in her lane? False, too. False. The lane is reserved for buses and taxis. True. Okay. And let's listen to the last part. That's weird. The last few cars driving toward us were flashing their lights. I see what you mean. There's another one. Maybe my lights are on or something. Let me check. No, they're off. Do you think there's an accident up ahead? Maybe you'd better slow down. Oh, now I see what's happening. There's a patrol car up ahead checking people's speed. How nice of those other drivers to let me know. Well, I'm within the speed limit. At least I am now. Page 96. Exercise. Okay, let's answer and then we listen to double check. The other drivers are flashing their lights? True. True, okay. He is driving with his lights on? False. Okay. The other drivers are giving him a warning. True. True. Okay. Let's listen and check your answers. As 11. Hmm. Let me try it here. Page 96, exercise 11, listening. What's in a sign? Part A, listen to three conversations about driving. Check true or false for each statement. One. Oh no, not another parking ticket. That's the second one this week. Why did I get a ticket for parking here? I thought this was a free parking zone. Maybe you can only park here after working hours. Is there a sign around anywhere? Oh, you're right. There's one over there. I didn't even notice it. Looks like you can't park here till after 6 p.m. How much is the fine? Would you believe it? $60. Two. I wonder why that traffic officer is signaling me. Perhaps he means you're driving too fast. No, I don't think so. The speed limit is 60, and I'm only going 55. Hmm. I wonder why there are no other cars in this lane. What do you mean? Well, you see how the other cars are all in the lane next to us? You're right. I think this one is just for buses and taxis. They really should put up better signs around here. Three. That's weird. The last few cars driving toward us were flashing their lights. I see what you mean. There's another one. Maybe my lights are on or something. Let me check. No, they're off. Do you think there's an accident up ahead? Maybe you'd better slow down. Oh, now I see what's happening. There's a patrol car up ahead checking people's speed. How nice of those other drivers to let me know. Well, I'm within the speed limit. At least I am now.
Okay. Page 96. Exercise 11. Apologies. Part B. Okay. Are there any that you want to change? All of them are okay? Yes. Okay, great. Let's take a look. Make sure that you have it. Everything is right. As you can see, this is the correct order. Perfect. Um, any questions about the vocabulary? It's clear the idea of the word fine or speed limit or uh, I don't know, flashing. All of those other words are okay. Teacher. It's okay. It's okay. All right. Great. So that means that now we completed unit four. We are finished with our unit four. Um, and then we only have unit five. And then we also have the idea for the final exam. In this moment, I'm going to give you two links. They're going to be into the in the chat. One moment. There's link number one. And there's link number two, okay? Now, the two links are to help us practice a little bit more on our speaking. So we're gonna choose different questions to ask each other. We're gonna make our partners speak. How long do the partners have to speak for? Well, the partners have to speak for at least 45 seconds for each question. So you're gonna ask your partner and you want to push your partner, you want to pressure your partner to make sure that they are speaking for at least 45 seconds and answering the question. We're gonna do one example to make sure that it's clear, okay? Ivan, can you ask me a question? No, teacher. Mm -hmm. Open the links, Ivan. Make sure that you have the links, open them up and ask a question. And you can open the link in my tablet picture. I have oh. a problem with this. Ah, Sorry. that's right. That's right. Okay. So we're going to have some issues there. Okay. Let's take a look. Um, Let's see. Uh, Giselle, can you ask me a question? No, teacher. <clears throat> Not teacher. Go ahead. Open up the links. Don't worry, Giselle. Yes. Okay, feel free. Any question you want? Gisela? Yes, teacher. Okay, ask me the question, Gisela. Referente a los links. That's correct, Gisela. Okay. Um, accidents at home. I have a question for you, teacher. Okay, Xiomara, go ahead. That way we can show Gisela and the others how to do it. Go ahead. Hey, how often do you go to the shopping mall? Okay. I usually only go to the shopping mall when I need something. But now that I change jobs, I go to the shopping mall every day, Monday through Friday, because I work in a shopping mall and also I go on Sundays. So is I don't go because I have to shop or buy anything, but I go there because I need to work there. One of the most difficult things in the shopping mall is parking. I find that a lot of people get stressed when they try to look for parking in the shopping malls because there are not enough spaces and there are too many cars. So in my case, I am lucky enough that I live close to my job and I walk there. And I usually walk to the shopping mall every time. Also, when I go out on the weekends with my family, we always try to go to a mall where we can find something to eat as well. Okay, wow. <laughs> 45 seconds. 45 yes. seconds. No sé qué más decir. I don't know. You have to speak for <laughs> five seconds. Okay. Okay. Your, the idea is you push your partner. You pressure your partner. Partner, here is the question. Speak. 45 seconds. Go. 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 
push your partner to continue speaking. No, I cannot think that. No, I don't know. But you have time. You still have more time, partner. You have to speak more. Are we ready? Yes. Yes? Okay. All right. So remember, ask the question. Don't share the question. Don't share the screen. The idea is not reading comprehension. It's listening comprehension. The partner has to listen and understand the question. It's okay. Does anybody have any questions? Okay. Then let's do it. We're going to have enough time to practice a few times with each partner. We have to use the same that yesterday used. Who is speaking? I see the all the microphones are turned off. Who is speaking? You have 45 seconds. Go. Gisela, Gabriel, Carla, what happened? You come to speak. Let's go. Let's go. Teacher, I have a question, but the questions that we have to use are the same that we used yesterday. No, they are, they are from the I, link. Mm -hmm. I don't see the link. Yes, the links in the chat. Yes, I don't have, I haven't. No lo copiaste? No, because I, I was connected. Okay. Connected. I, don't worry, I put again. No, thank you. Look. Gabriel, Gisela, are you there? Okay, Carla, te voy a mover a otro grupo porque solo vos estás participando. Okay. Okay. About how many different colors food did you eat for dinner? What happened? <laughs> okay. We're going to make some more groups. Hang on. We're going to make a little bit more because we have some people that cannot speak. We had one group where only one person had the microphone and they didn't say anything. Okay. Acuérdense, si no pueden participar, pónganse la palabra oyente al inicio de su nombre para que no estamos como en una C11. Allí buscando, eh, 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 y, de, y nunca contesta la persona. Okay, so let me try one more time. Voy a poner los oyentes a los que no se pusieron ellos. Okay. 
Perfect. All right, teacher, I need to put oyente for a while. Okay, cool problem, David. Excellent. Eso es perfecto. O sea, it's okay. If you have an issue, no problem. Mm -hmm. All right. So let's make the groups again. Let me put, I'm okay, going to, okay. no problems. The idea is for everybody to participate. We're going to have all of the oyentes together. And then we're going to try to make the other ones a little bit better. Okay. Let's make sure. Okay, so we got. Okay. All right, perfect. Now we can practice. Hello, who is there? <laughs> Your partner left. Your partner was here and then disappeared. I'm yes. Going... <laughs> it's, a, it's a problem. Okay, I'm going to put you to another group. Don't worry. Okay. An actor. An actor. Uh -huh. Do you think anyone can become an actor? Oh, yeah. I think that someone, if they want to make an actor, uh, yes, I someone become an actor. Only, I think, in my opinion, only that thing for become an actor, it's uh, make a study about what is the the goals or the objective for to do. For example, if, if something make a, a theater, 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 I don't, I don't know what to say, theater, theater, and some, someone need to um, make a presentation about uh, the opera, and this, star, this person uh, is become to study, to study, to study, and practice, I think someone make a, an actor, become an actor. And for the for the woman, uh, I don't know what they say. Sure. Hello, everyone. Airplanes or uh, art. Well, hi. I okay. want to talk about este, my, my job is, uh, is basketball, is my sport favorite. And now uh, I ride bike. I have two bicycles and uh, one motorcycle. And this is my passion. Uh, I feel happy when I, I, I go in the road. Uh, until switch to the city. Okay. To the city in the morning, like a two, no, one over and half to arrive at uh, switch to the city. Es una carretera preciosa, bicicleta. Okay, you ride your bike, your motorcycle. I ride bike and motorcycle too. Ah, okay, my motorcycle okay. is for, to to uh, send my food, my pizzas, uh, because I I deliver my pizzas. What? You, you, I deli I'm delivery. Uh huh. I'm delivery with my pizzas. For that ah, reason, okay. I for that reason I have my my motorcycle. Ah, okay, okay. And, and you, my, Carla? And my, Oh, excuse me, excuse me, continue. No, 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 yeah, no, 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 okay. Carlita. <laughs> Carla? Mm, 
a question. Yes. Do you buy products because of advertising? Excuse me, I can hear you pretty well. Do you buy products because of advertising? If I have products for advertising. Buy. Uh -huh. Ah, buy. Uh, sometimes. Yes, sometimes. I buy, for example, food and clothes or shoes. <laughs> Many kinds of products. But not all the time it's uh safe to buy in this in this form, I think. Because um I have to I como se dice I don't remember the word experience. Uh where when I have I have received my products. Okay. Yes. Uh, Eli, Eli, Eli. Yes. Nelly. 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 Yes. Thing is really, uh, exciting because for me it's very it's very fantastic. Because I, I have a lot of dream to 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 finish. For example, I I I did I think because I <laughs> I, I I have I I I I am excited, but it's very well. Okay, okay. And your opinion, Simona? What do you think about you? You will buy a, a bill to or a lottery lotto with the number five. Would you have a dream? Portado. Hola, hello, hello. Can you repeat the question, please? Okay. Um, when you wake up. And you have a dream with a buy or you want the lottery or the lotto with a number five when a, you want a one million dollar. When you wake up, you will go to the buy a, a bill or the lotto number five. Or maybe you win, win the lotto. <laughs> no, if the, if the about if the lotto will be. Uh, this reality maybe is telling me something else. <laughs> <laughs> In what nightmares? What the worst nightmare you have ever had? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes, Daniel. Yeah, yeah. How are you? <laughs> oh, did you have a question? No, no, no. Have a question. Only I, I sent a reading. For okay. Real. All right. <laughs> okay. I'm going to help you so that way we can try to improve a little bit more. The objective is for pushing you to speak and for having the amount of time. You need to have a timer. So the one person needs to have the timer. Remember, like the example, 45 seconds. No vean nadie siguiendo el ejemplo. Ni un solo grupo. Right? It's not speaking to your friends. It's speaking to improve your English. You need to focus in your English, focus in the grammar, focus in the questions, right? 
try to make sure that you are speaking correctly because it's not good if you are speaking in different orders. Uh, example is, I understand. Eh, pupusa, querés, hambre, eh, tenés, el eh, uh, mejor lugar? No, you, you have to listen to what you are saying. You have to listen because if you don't listen to what you are saying, then you are going to continue to speak like that. And the idea is to improve. How do we improve? By putting metrics. What are the metrics? Just like a business. How do you know if you improve sales? More money. How do you know if you have more customers? More response in social media. How do you know? The same, the same in English. We need metrics. What are the metrics? Okay, we have the time, 45 seconds. How many sentences do you say in 45 seconds? The partner count, right? How many sentences? What is your idea? Because if you are 45 seconds and you only say three or four sentences, is is not good. It's not good to communicate. The person listening is not going to pay attention, right? So that's why it's important to speak fluently. How do we speak fluently? Organize your idea and then speak. What happened? I teach, I don't have vocabulary. Use the vocabulary you have. Don't think about Spanish. Don't use Spanish. The Spanish is bad, 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 bad. Mm -hmm. Right? Why? Because the Spanish is not going to reach your goal. The more Spanish you use, the less you're going to reach your goal. So the Spanish is nice. Oh, I explain. Yes, but here we are partners. We all speak Spanish. What happened if somebody come from Canada, from Australia, New England, Japan, Russia? You're going to speak Spanish. They're not going to understand. So one more time. Watch the time. Make sure you count the sentences. We're going to practice in this moment. Everybody, everybody, have your timer. Todos, todos, tomen el tiempo. Vamos a ver. Okay. Hector, ask me a question. We're going to try it. Hi, everyone. Good evening. Okay, teacher. Um, what kind of movie would you like to act in? Oh, wow. Hector, I think that I would love to act in movies such as Marvel's because in Marvel movies, they have a lot of different publicity and very famous. One of the things that I really like about movies is that you can be different people. So I would love to act in movies such as in crime movies or actions and dramas. This would give me the ability and the possibility to meet other actors. I think acting is a very hard talent because not everybody has the possibility to cry or show emotions in any moment or any situations. For me, one of the best actors, I think, is an actor called uh, Andrew Smith. Andrew Smith has starred in many different movies, and he has won many Academy Awards. For me, he is one of the best because the time? That's it. Time, teacher. Time. Okay. okay. Daniel, ¿cuántas oraciones dije? Ese era tu trabajo. Un, ese era tu trabajo. <laughs> Yo llevaba el tiempo, yo llevaba el tiempo. Yo, yo el tiempo, yo el tiempo. Mm. Carla, ¿cuántas oraciones dije? No. Many, many, many. Ok. Ahora, ¿por qué es importante? Porque si no sabes, no tenés un punto de partida, no sabes si estás mejorando tu fluidez. ¿Cómo sabes que estás hablando más? ¿Cómo sabes que estás mejorando fluidez? Ah, ni idea. Imagínate hace tres meses, ¿cuánta oración decías en 30 segundos? Ni idea. Entonces, de aquí en tres meses, ¿cómo sabes que de verdad te ha funcionado inglés corporativo? ¿Cómo sabes que tú has hecho lo que tienes que hacer para estar al nivel que querés y es ser bilingüe? Encontrar trabajo en un call center, encontrar a ir de turismo a otro país, es hablar con otra gente cuando entras por aduanas e inmigración. Ah, lo tenés que medir. Entonces, como cuando uno estamos hablando, no podemos medir. Estamos preocupados de hablar. Para eso está el compañero. Tiempo y oraciones. ¿Yes? Ok. Tienen trabajo. Ahí no, no es de que, ah, déjalo hablar y, y voy a pensar yo en mi respuesta. ¿Qué le voy a decir? No, 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 no. Una pregunta, 
para el compañero y otra pregunta para el otro compañero. Nadie va a repetir la misma pregunta. Porque si no, ya estás pensando. Y la idea no es prepararte. La idea es en el momento que puedes hacer. Si yo te doy un mes para preparar una presentación, yo sé, te la memorizas y uy, como que si fueras nativo. Pero queremos hablar fluido. Ok, so time and sentences. It's clear? Yes, Daniel. I have a question. Of course. Uh, what is the mechanism to, to reach, to count how many phrases says when a uh, when I finish the 45 min second oh. what is the mechanism for for reach to count so you are going to count the sentences not the pauses is very good question so for example uh, my favorite movie is is not a sentence this is not a sentence I need to my partner needs to finish my favorite movie is um John Wick because I like uh, Keanu Reeves is one sentence. Que me tardé un montón es diferente, pero solo es una oración. That's the idea. The idea is okay. use and speak and speak. speak. Very good speak. question. Now, remember, what is the goal? The goal is 12 sentences in 45 seconds. 12 sentences in 45 seconds. But... We need to know how many you have. Maybe David has eight. Maybe Carla has three. Maybe Daniel has 12. Maybe Hector has two. It's okay. It's okay. But we don't improve if we don't know how we begin. Okay. It's clear, Daniel? Okay, it's clear. Thank okay. you. Okay, Daniel. I'm going to listen. Voy a ir a tu grupo a ver si está contando. <laughs> okay all right let's start this any other questions no more question for me teacher no it's all clear okay if it's all clear let's practice then Hello. Hi, Samara. Okay, let's continue. I have the time. <laughs> okay, uh, who starts? Ah, uh, if you want. Okay. Um, I, I was, I... Yes, I have the... I have a topic the the dreams. Excuse me. Uh, I choose the topic okay. dreams. Dreams. Yes. Okay. Uh, do you do you usually remember your dreams? Okay. Uh, tomorrow, most of the time, yes, I I remember my dreams. But I I used to I don't used to dream because all the time I'm very tired and I think that's the why I don't dream a lot or I dream very late. I'm the last of my family to to rest and I think I sleep very very a short time. I think that's the why I I don't drink too much. But when I dream, yes, I I remember. Okay. Xiomara, so, how many sentences did Nelly say? How many? Sentences. I seen three. Three sentences. Three. Well, okay. Thank you, thank you. Como que estamos inventando porque no, I counted, I counted too. 
Mm-hmm. How many? <laughs> six sentences. Six sentences. Six. Okay. Yeah. So we are 50%. I can't... We are 50%. We need to practice to the other, right? Okay. Now, for me, it's a little bit difficult to listen very well because David is it, next to me and he talks louder than no me. No problem. Because now you are going to ask Xiomara and you don't have to speak. Only listen to Xiomara. Okay. And can you okay. can you take the time too? Because I I yes. don't have take the time, time, Nelly. Take the time and count the sentences, Nelly, like me. Okay. I will count the sentences and take the time. Okay. Uh um, uh, I will ask you about uh, gifts. Okay. Yeah. When this couple in the family, to, uh, there are a lot of a, a lot of problems for your life. For example, we don't say, we don't we don't have a a pace and don't have a, a happiness, felicidad. How do you say it? But uh, when when we don't when we uh, fight with the other person, for example, when when with my wife, I fight. Uh, we we. Time. It is time. Time. <laughs> and you, Daniel, how do you how do you resolve the conflicts in your work? One moment, David. One moment. Uh, okay. Dan Daniel, how many sentences did Hector say? Seven sentences. That's good, Hector. That's good. Do you want to go to 12? Seven is a little bit more than 50% is good. If you see, at the beginning, for you, was easy. At the beginning, you start to speak. And then the more you speak, uy, mi idea, ya no sé qué decir. And then... <laughs> good, good, good. Yes. That's why, Hector, is necessary. It's necessary to speak longer. That way you have more fluency, not only short answers, not only yes, no, okay, no problem. No, give more details, give more. That way you can improve, okay? okay? So now remember, count the sentences for the next partner and watch the time. <clears throat> Thank you, David. So Hector, did you, okay. uh, did you have some? We have to. Okay. Next, then <laughs> the next question. <laughs> okay. Um... Easy, easy. <laughs> easy peasy. <laughs> uh, wait. Are you interested in the world of business? Are you interested? In the world of business. Yes, yes the, I, I like the business because it's money in my hand. I I need it to my family. I like the business and, and it, the business give us money for 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 buy este for buy our necessities, but this is very, very good. I like it, the business. Uh, I have a, my business, me, our business, I'm making pizza. I have a, a little pizza in my house. I'm making with my wife and, and my son uh, all the products, all the pizzas, uh, budding, we, mm -hmm. we're making budding too. Mm -hmm. oh, Banana and pineapple. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, Carla. A little bit more time. A little bit more time you gave him, but more or less. More. <laughs> Carla, how many sentences did Ivan say? Five. <laughs> Correct. Correct. Ivan said five sentences in 45 seconds. Mm -hmm. Okay, Ivan. It's not too bad. But remember, the objective is 12 sentences in 45 seconds. 12? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Just like when you speak uh, 
when you speak Spanish, the same 12 sentences in 45 seconds. No, um, eh, uh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But I, 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 I have, a, I gonna connect my mind with my tongue. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Speak English very well. <laughs> that, that's why we practice. The more you practice, the more vocabulary you have, the more details, the more fluency. Now, Ivan, the same for Carla. You need to watch the time and you need to count the sentences in 45 seconds. Did you understand how to do it, Ivan? Yes, yes. Okay. Yes, teach. Okay. okay, perfect. Come on, Carla. Okay. Uh, blah, blah. Okay. <laughs> the next question. Mm, it's for I like you. you. I like how you changed to English very quickly, Nelly. Mm. What? what? Uh -huh. you, you see that? No, we were we were talking about David. Yes, yes, he speaks very loud. Yes. Uh huh. For the Are next time, I will go other, other room. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's like in the market. In the market, tomatoes, 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 potato, potato. <laughs> <laughs> Nelly. Yeah. So Nelly. Yes. Do, do you like when you when someone uh, give you flowers? Do you like flowers? Oh, yes, like I love gift? flowers. I love flowers. I my best gift are flowers. Okay. My yes. favorite and chocolates too. <laughs> I I like um I don't know what's the name in English. Orchids and uh, yerberas. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Yes, the, the yerberas. But in the, English, I don't know. The other ones are the yellow ones, mm -hmm. like uh like a shine, like a sun. Mm -hmm. Girasols? No. <laughs> I mean baby. <laughs> <laughs> What's the name, teacher? Okay. Uh, those are my my favorite flowers. Okay. Yes. Okay, Nelly, more or less. So one of the techniques that you need to use, Nelly, is when you are speaking and you don't know the technical name, don't use the technical name. Use the color. Yes, I said yellow flowers. Exactly. Like sun. Exactly. And the name is sunflower. Sunflower. Yes, oh. this is the name. But the same for the other flowers. Now, one of the things that you have to develop, Nelly, is description. You mentioned the flowers. You answer the question, yes, I like flowers. Uh, I like <laughs> these flowers. But then you need to give description. When was the last time you got flowers? Uh, what was the um, event where you had the best flowers? Or why would you? The idea is continue, not repeat the same information. The idea is you okay. answer the question and then support your answer. Okay. Okay, okay. okay. Siomara, how many sentences did Nelly say? I forgot. Yo sé, uh, yo sé. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. No. Don't worry. Okay, very nice job. I like it. I like it. It's getting better. I listen to many groups, many partners. I listen. We are getting six, seven, eight. Excellent. Remember, that is the objective. The objective is 12. So remember, write it down in the notebook today. Write it down. Ah, uh, July 19th, boom, seven sentences in 45 seconds, 12 sentences in 45. Write it down that way in the next module in two weeks, I check and I say, hey, how's your English? And you say, oh, hey, teacher, now I have 10 sentences. Now I almost natural. Hey, this is the idea. The idea not only, uh, eh, no, the idea is details and information. Now, the other technique, one thing that in general we have to work on is 
support with examples, not repeat the same answer, right? Because many times we are thinking, ah, oh, do you like it? Yes, I like it. It's very nice. It's good. It's one of my favorites. I really like, and you, I like it. I like it like seven times, eight times, but you don't say anything. So answer the question, why? Answer the question and why? Do aliens exist? Yes, yes. Because, and, and then explain why, your point of view. Always give the idea to practice to use more. And the third technique is when you don't have the vocabulary, don't use it. How do you say, ay, como se dice? No. Como se dice? No. You, you, what you have, you use. Ay, si tuviera un millón de dólares, compraría una casa. No lo tengo. No lo voy a comprar. ¿Para qué lo estoy pensando? Go. Voy a comprar lo que tengo. So the same thing with your vocabulary. Ay, como se dice? I don't know. I write it down and I look for it for homework because I need it for me. I need it for my speaking. Maybe my partner doesn't need it for their speaking, but that is the idea, okay? Write it down. Oh, this word I'm going to investigate. This word I'm going to expand my vocabulary. This is the best way. Push yourself, okay? Answer the questions. Watch the time, 12 sentences. Give the details and use the vocabulary that you have. You only have a little vocabulary, okay? Use the little vocabulary, only English and English and English, and try to combine it with others. The other part is try to use words that help you tell a story, no give instructions, right? Always like things that help you connect because, therefore, so, also, and, but. That way you try to combine together. So let's find out. David, how many sentences in 45 seconds for you? I don't know. I never <laughs> counted. I count, I count the, the, the phrases to David and David reached eight. Eight. Hey, yes. A little bit more, David. Very nice. A little bit more. We need 12. We need 12. Almost, almost there, David. Okay, Ivan, how many sentences for you? How many sentences in 45 seconds? Five, five. Okay, good. Mañana serán seis. A little, a little sentence. That's it. It's okay. Tomorrow is going to be five. Yes, with tomorrow will be more. Or more. Exactly. This is the idea. Push yourself. Push yourself every day more and more. Yes. Daniel, how many sentences for you? I don't know. Maybe I think six mm. sentences. I don't know. Who is David? Did you count Daniel's sentences? David Jones. Yes. Uh, uh, I count six. Six. Okay, so 50%. Okay, we need to work a little bit more, 50%. Good. Carla, how about you? How many sentences? Uh, four or five. <laughs> four or five. That's okay. Tomorrow, five or six. Tomorrow, five or six. We push a little bit more. Next week, five or six. Imagine, Carla, one sentence. One sentence more every week. In three months, you are speaking like natural. Only one sentence in the week. And in three months, you are speaking like a natural person. That is why it's clear goals. You need to be clear your level and what you need to achieve. Hector, how about you? How many? I think it's about seven sentences teaching. Seven, more than 50%. Good. Push yourself. Tomorrow, eight. Tomorrow, eight. Okay. Good. Nelly, for you? It's uh, seven, no, six. Six. Ah, está aumentando, Nelly. Ah, uh -huh, uh -huh. The second time, I the count six. seven. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, so about 50%. That's good. Yeah. Six or seven, six or seven. That's good. Tomorrow, seven or eight, seven or eight. That's the idea. And Xiomara, for you? Um... um... I think very few teacher. Uh, yes. Three, four, <laughs> how many? More, more, uh, less, less from five. Okay, it's okay. Tomorrow, tomorrow you try to go for five. Tomorrow, five, five, five. I will try to sleep at mornings a pair of hours more because I, I think very, I am very. Uh, 
I don't know how to how do you say eh, ganas, eh, de, de, I have take a lot of and chlorpheniramine is is uh, me uh -huh. me hace it's okay you have a lot of drugs no problem sí. mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know if for that but tomorrow yeah. I tomorrow try to better. yes okay excellent remember tomorrow we try to do more we try to push more okay okay teacher. Thank excellent you. job excellent thank you guys so much and we see tomorrow one more sentence one more sentence one more teacher ten more sentences tomorrow will be <laughs> the best the best uh -huh. <laughs> good night good Hector, night. you have a question good night everyone Bye, everyone Daniel. All right, good night. Nice to see you guys.